wondered why some lights at home may work and some not even if you turned it on? Do these light bulbs connected to one another? Well, this video will answer those questions. Since we cannot live without electricity for a very long period, electricity is something that we would have a hard time living without. We need to understand how electricity flows. The real sense is a current of electricity can only move in a complete circuit. Then what is a circuit all about? A circuit is just a closed loop or a path that an electron or electric current can travel in. The sources of electricity have been differentiated from a mains electricity to a battery, which provide electrical energy in the circuit. No electrons will move unless the circuit is complete because it makes a full circle back to the electrical source with no beginning and no ending. So why do we need circuits? The circuit carries useful energy through our house that we can use for a variety of tasks. For example, we love a well-lighted house, we can watch TV, put our foods in the fridge, and heat the food in the microwave. There are two basic types of circuits in electricity. One, series circuit, and two, parallel circuits. These two differ in the number of loops through which current can flow. Then what is a series circuit? It is when electricity flows in one path, the same current flows through all the components. Example, if you have three bulbs connected by a series loop, all the bulbs in a series circuit will share the same path. In a series circuit, the electricity flows from the battery to each of the bulbs and then back to the battery. If one bulb goes out in a series circuit, then all of the bulbs will go out because the electrical current path is disrupted or incomplete. This is the disadvantage of a series circuit. If more bulbs are added to a series circuit, then the bulbs will grow dimmer. This is due to the fact that the same amount of electricity is being distributed among more objects. Now, what will happen if one bulb is out or not working in a series circuit? If any one of the bulbs is missing or burned out, no current will flow and none of the lights will go on. The second type of circuit happens when electricity flows in more than one path on the same circuit. This is where all components are connected across each other's terminals. The current will split into different branches, then combines again before it goes back into the supply. This is what we call parallel circuit. Look at the example. Each bulb has its own path for electricity, so the bulbs in a parallel circuit are brighter than in a series circuit. The electricity in a parallel circuit will continue to flow as long as the switch is on. If a bulb breaks or goes out in a parallel circuit, the other bulbs will not go out because they are not on the same path as the broken bulb. Therefore, the circuits are complete for the bulbs that are working, but the broken bulb circuit is incomplete. Then. What do you think is the type of circuit used in houses and businesses? Great! It is usually run on parallel circuits. So, if you learn new things today, drop your comments below, like and share this video, subscribe and hit the bell button to notify you in my upcoming videos.